and welcome to my channel i am going to do access module 3 and a module project 1 basically this is the third module of exact section of this course i will do this assignment step by step and you can get your assignment done by watching this complete video if you want me to do this assignment for you or if you want me to do this complete course for you including all the excel assignments all the word assignments powerpoint assignments Outlook assignment, you can contact me and you can hire me for your complete course. You can also hire me for your other courses like accounting, management, finance, information technology, computer sciences, all other writing assignments, mathematics, statistics, etc. Let's start this assignment and solve this assignment step by step so that you can get your assignment done by watching this video. So this is new perspective access 2019 module 3 and a module project 1 on start partners creating and improving queries getting started with the assignment we are supposed to download this uh, database file i have already downloaded this one and you can download this from your school or cngage login and this is the file that we are going to use to get this assignment ready for the submission we will apply all the instructions all the project steps to this database file and we will solve the assignment step by step in this file. So let's move to the project steps and total steps to solve in this assignment are 8 and we are supposed to solve 8 steps in this assignment. So let's move to step number 1. Homestead Partner is a company that connects independent homeowners with long term renters. You work in the customer service department of Homestead Partners as a data analyst. You are developing an access database application to help manage and analyze several types of customer service data including the property and the property manager effectiveness. Open the properties table in the datasheet view. So we are supposed to open the property table in the datasheet view. Okay. And in the record with the property number value of 2, property number value of 2, this one, Victor Hogg, Victor Hogg, insert Georgia for the F name value and Brickley for the last name value. F name value should be Georgia. G or G and the L name Brickley. Brickley for the last name value. Hide the path and deposit column. Bath and deposit columns that you do not contain any data that they do not contain any data. So that is all about step number one. So we have solved step number one. Now we will move to the next step that is step number two. With the properties table still open in the datasheet view, modify the expression in calculated in calculated application fee field to multiply by 15 instead of 10. So we are supposed to we are supposed to open 
with the properties table still open in the data sheet view properties table is already open in the data sheet view and we are supposed to modify the expression in the calculated application fee field calculated application fee field this one modify the expression we are supposed to modify the expression and we are supposed to multiply by 15 instead of 10 so we are supposed to modify multiply by 15 instead of 10 apply the last filter the state field is equal to ga state field equal to ga Where is GA? Where is GA? G state field is equal to G A this one G A so equals to G A this one you can see the state field is equal to G A sort the record in ascending order by the L name field L name field is here and we are supposed to sort in ascending order and then save and close the properties table so now we are supposed to save and close this table so that is all about step number two so we have solved second step as well and now we're going to do next step that is step number three So now let's do step number three. So open the surveys table in the data sheet view and sort the record in descending order by the survey date. So first we are supposed to open the survey data, uh, survey table in the data sheet view, and then we are supposed to sort the record in descending order by the survey date. Survey date and descending order. So now the service table has been sorted in descending order by the survey date. Change the font size to 12 points and apply Arial as the font save and close the survey table. Font size should be 12 points. And it should be in Arial. And then we are supposed to save and close the survey table. Save this one and close this one. So that is all required in step number three. So basically we have solved three steps of this assignment so far. And now we are going to do next step. That is step number four. So open the manager listing query and data sheet view. Manager listing query 
in data sheet view and from for property number 13 property number 13 where is 13 property number 13 property number 13 is here change the manager id values to 1 manager id values to 1 Note that the manager name value will automatically appear to Washington. You can see that manager last name value has been changed to the Washington. Due to the relationship between manager ad field and the properties table. So basically I have solved four steps out of the eight steps that is almost 50% to 60% of this assignment. But if you want me to do this complete assignment for you, you can contact me through WhatsApp or email that is showing at the bottom of the screen and you can hire me to do this assignment for you. You can also hire me to do this complete course for you that includes all the Excel, Word, PowerPoint or Outlook assignments. I have been doing courses for students since 2015 and you can ask me to do any course for you. I will produce a grade for you. My WhatsApp number and email is showing at the bottom of the screen. Please contact me and I will be doing quality and professional and timely work for you. Thank you so much for watching my video. I will get back to you with another video.